Hello YouTube, ObiStar66 here, and welcome back to Zero Caliber, and today we are going to do some more, I guess you could say customizations, or we'll do a mission today with those customizations. So, here, I want to see what I can make. So, ah, uh, shoot, my headset's getting a little bit foggy. But, uh, here, what do we want to use? I'm thinking about using... I'm not much of a fan of the AR-4, even though it is American type. Someone's gonna say in the comments, well, it is American, why, and since you're American, why don't you just use it? You know what, fine. Fuck. It's just because, like, honestly, like, I don't usually use this weapon that often. And mostly, oh my god, my headset's getting kind of foggy. Like, I'm not gonna lie, it's getting kind of crispy. Like, I mean, that's not an issue, it's just kind of annoying. Because it's like, I'm like, damp and sweaty. So, like, like it's probably that's why, but I don't have any of those rags, so we're gonna have to deal with this. Let's see how good I am at shooting while being blinded by a, um, by a, you know, by a mist. So, I think I want to go to grab a shotgun here. What shotgun do I want to use? I'm gonna go for the, uh, I have almost every shotgun unlocked, except for I'm not unlucky. I like to keep one weapon locked up. Like, not, like, 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 not buy it. Like, I didn't pay for it. Because that one-hand shotgun, I like the ones with the stocks. But the, uh, shotguns, you can make them a long range by... I can't remember how I did it in the video. I think it was the, uh, here. We're gonna just add that scope on there. I think it was the, uh, CVA, like, sniper scope. It's, like, it's, like, a silencer, like, a T or something. It was, like, a silencer, one of those silencers that, like, I rarely use. So I think it was, uh, I think it was, the, oh no, it was this one. This is the one here. You guys can see it. I kind of can't. It's this one here. That's the silencer that my friend, Maternal's Eye, told me to use. He, we were making a video and he told me, use that silencer. And I was like, okay. It was before we made that video. But like, actually, you know what? I'd rather actually use the bayonet. Because it would, it would make a lot more sense if I needed to, to harm someone. Plus, I love the bayonet, so I couldn't leave without it. You know, so why don't we do it? Just makes it a lot more weirder. Oh, crap. Well. There's actual water sounds in this map. I didn't notice that. Actually, weird. this is not the map I want to choose. Wrong map. Dang it. Um. That was the wrong map. Even though I would have gone for the map of the house, we are gonna choose a, uh, I would say, uh, let's see here. I think I wanna choose, um, this one because I'd help some rebels, I believe is what they are. I don't know what they are. This game doesn't give you much info on what things are. Also, my, I can only see the recording on my left eye on the other end. It's like foggy, so it's like, it's like I got my eye covered. It's kind of annoying. But this AR-4 is not the best of designs, I would say. In my mind, like, the AR-4, okay, it's American model, but people have complained about it a little bit. Due to its jamming ability. And that's why you need the, this is a, a pusher assist, or force assist, that allows you to, like, uh, like help with, like, the bolt, like, if it doesn't, like, drive forward. Stand your ground, fellas. If I Stick die, I'm gonna blame my, my height, like... We had no reinforcements. I'm at my appropriate height. Why am I so? Why am I slow? I am so slow. And I don't know why I'm doing that. I don't know why I can't like move. There we go. I heard someone in. Heard someone in here. Where are they at? Oh my god! <laughs> I am not joking guys, I can kind of not see out of my right eye. So I have to focus forward like this, so you guys are gonna see it in the middle, but it, it helps me a little bit. Oh no. It helps me, cause like, I'm seeing in the middle here. So it's in the middle of my face. Like, I know it's not like, appropriate to do it, but that's how I can see. But this AR-4, I hate to say it, but I actually misjudged it. I guess don't judge a gun by its cover until you try it out, I guess, right? Or, or judge it by its caliber and get it. It's a, it's, I'm sorry, it's a gun joke. Oh, God, 
This is like the best thing I've ever done. I, I like making videos on this game, and we are close to 100. I thought it would be Brick Bricks that we get ahead, but since of like things with Brick Bricks, I haven't been able to make much videos off of it, which I'll try to make one today later on. But right now, that's just not gonna be a thing right now, but like, I have something to go to later, so. Which is private information, I'm just being stupid. I, li I like how every time I just try to say stuff, and then I, I go ahead and do it. I don't know why, that's like something with me. Like, we haven't tried the shotgun yet, which this is gonna, like, I don't like pointing it down the front end, which is not appropriate, or not, like, like, I just want you guys to be able to see it. Like, you guys can see me aiming with, like, the scope. Like, I've seen parts where I go like this, where I, where I go like this, and you guys are able to kind of see it, but, like, when I do it like this, I think it helps a little bit, because the revolver is such at a weird angle in the game, like, how far up the scope is, it helps. And I know it, I can't, I'm not yelling, like, I'm kind of yelling right now, even though it sounds like I'm, like, kind of, like, talking normal. I'm, I have a little bit high on my voice, like, my, my voice is a little bit high. Someone's gonna say, you better, you should have just enabled, put that silencer on the shotgun. I feel like someone's gonna say that. Like, even though no one is going to. So, like, none of you guys comment, except for one guy does, on my channel, and I've been getting a lot of comments from him, which is kind of funny to think about. Like, I would also like to hear some jokes about this game, because I, I would love to hear some. Got two for one kill. You guys could see how I'm like moving kind of weird. This is not me doing it on purpose. I have like stick. I don't have stick. What is wrong with my height? Okay, okay. Ugh, this is gonna be like a like a, a quick fix. What happened with my height? What is wrong with my height? That's my height in real life. Why is it not? Okay, there we go. I, I am five point seven, so it's at my real life. Why am I getting this issue? Is it because I grew overnight? Is that why? Okay. 5.8. Does that help? Okay. Oh my god, this character, like, can't move at all. I don't know. I don't know if it's the weapons I'm carrying or if it's just that, like, my height. Like, I don't know if that's a problem because sometimes that is a problem for games. Because I am 5.7, it had no issues with that before. And now I'm doing it 5.8 because I think I grew an extra, like, foot overnight. So I guess that makes sense. You're OSA. Oh, that's a relief. We had to delay them while our families get away. The Loki are not around. If they find you. Sounds multiple hostiles approaching your location. Defensive positions near the house. I've got visual. Oh, please, not again. feels so weird. Like, this feels like a tactical weapon, but it kind of feels like it's not, until I look at the top. This other feels not that controllable. Why can I not move correctly? It's so weird. Is that it? I wish you can like draw them out here. Look out there, there's one. Not gonna lie, he scared me. 
Yeah. What is wrong with that? Like, that's, that's such a huge issue. No need. The evac team will arrive soon. You better get going ASAP. Now I'm jumping on control, but great. Come on, fellas. We're leaving this hellhole. Nice. That's just great. <sighs> nice. Okay. So, there's also this switch I want to do, too, because, like, but we're gonna, we're gonna head back to base real quick to get a different weapon, because, like, the Air Force is nice, I'll say that. But it's not, like, the best. That's what I'm thinking. I want to change it up to make it look more, like, pro-style. So, here, we're going to take the AKM. Like, like, basically, I did not know how this weapon looked until I thought. So, then, like, the AKM. But, you know, there's not much gold in American weapons. Except for the Grand doesn't have that kind of kick. Right here, we're going to do a drum mag. Or do I want to just do an example? I think I just want to do this clip because it looks cool. But the drum mag would give us 10% ammo. I think we're going to do drum mag because it, it looks weird. On the, it doesn't look weird, but it looks perfect on the gun. We're going to do red dot sight. And we're going to do a laser. Silencer. We're going to do the classic silencer I always use for this gun. There we go. But we're going out golden here, but I don't know what else would be golden. An offense to like a shotgun. I know that this one's golden, but I'm not paying for it. Uh, is there any other alternative? Or is that the only shotgun that ha that's? I'm not sure. I need to figure which. I don't know if any of these other ones have any like other like you no know, it's silver, it's silver. So it's not gonna help us here. Skins for this one. Is there any skins for this one? It's just silver too. Uh, what else is a new alternative to a weapon that like could be held in one handed? What gun does have that skin design? I guess, like, I guess the, like, I guess this would be our best option here. Because the pistol, but it also comes in a gold color. Where is its gold color? Oh, there it is. Found it. Why is it the second one? It makes no sense. Okay, there we go. And this is the last one. This is so weird. How they switch it around. That's so weird. Anyway, I think I want to, just because it looks stupid, I want to go for a big scope. Go for the, this, I think, no, is that the right one? Is that the... Yeah, we're gonna go for that one. Give it a laser sight. And boom. This looks so stupid, but it, it works nonetheless, I would say. So we're just gonna live with it. But the AK looks like, it looks spicy. It looks good. Nice and shiny. So we're gonna do that, go to that mission, and we're good. If you're wondering why I'm going gold as well, it's like a customization to the weapon. So I'm counting it as another custom weapon design. You know these weapons don't seem custom and crazy? Like, that's because I don't have, like, the stuff that I would want to put onto it. Like, they're coming out, like I said, I said this yesterday, they're coming out with, uh, with the, um, uh, what are they coming out with? Like, the, the, the crossplay, which means that people in the game could switch over to, to from PC and, and, uh, Quest can play, but they'll see, the players will stay the same for each other, but... Like, people who have the tactical flashlight in the game, like, they'll probably add that, I'm hoping. Mostly, the, the things that get updated in this game, every almost like every day, is mostly just bugs. So, I don't know if that's gonna be, like, a thing or not, but I'm hoping. I'm hoping. I wish I could come to them and ask them for that, because that would be, like, the coolest thing ever and be useful. And... And some people don't usually ask for that, but, like, I feel like that would be a nice audition to, to it. Like, there's a reason why I kind of want to get the Quest version. Or not the Quest version, the, uh, the Rift, uh, Quest Rift, like, like, uh, like, Steam version. I want to get the Steam version of Zero Caliber. Like, that's what I'm saying. Because, like, they have the tactical flashlight that I'm looking for, but they don't necessarily use it. That, like, people I've seen use it a lot. Which it is useful, and I would say it is useful, but that's why I attach the red laser, because I also like it. But it doesn't give me that, like, use I would like. Because it's kind of like use- I have to back away for that airstrike when it comes in. But you guys could see where I'm kind of, like, at that point where I, I kind of, like, in this game, I'm kind of, like, since we made 50 episodes now, well, now counting 51, it would be a huge, like, blessing for that to be in the update. Like, I would love that. Oh. 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 
This thing sounds so weird while it's silenced. I can't leave such more clear now. It was foggy earlier, now it's clear. What the heck? them. I just want to talk about so the creators who, who see my videos like because they have like a playlist or something to show for the videos below like down below in the in the description you could see a little thing talking about zero caliber and it will explain what um what it was or what it is technically like here I'll, I'll give you guys an example but I'm gonna use my original uh, gun like my original loadout my first loadout to Explain to you guys what I'm talking about why the flashlight be useful So this map used to be daytime now. It's nighttime and it is so dark to see the enemies Enough already for me that I think That um it, it would actually be a night. It would actually be a blessing if they could actually have the same like I'm not really saying that because it actually is dark This map actually could use it a lot And I wish the sewers were more darker because it would look like because I like the darkness like kind of in the game because it adds like Realism, and this is like the only dark map I know of, including like, the one area in the map that's a dark as well. So I think that the flashlight would actually be useful for like the dark maps. For people who can't see the enemy, and it like, like shines them or blinds them, like real life. Like that's where I think it would be cool to have that attachment in the game. Even though I would say I don't think they're adding any more attachments, it's mostly just bugs they've been doing. And like... That's where I feel like some attachments would be nice to add in order to match their skill level, you know? Because, but it just feels so stupid that they won't do that. Like, they won't just add in some of the stuff that the PC people use. Because, like, I have it, like I said, I could pay for it myself. But if I find, my parents find out, I hate to say it, guys, this is a true thing I want to say on camera because it makes me feel bad. And I just need some support. Like, I just feel, like, terrible. I just, I'm not saying I'm trying to guilt trip you guys, I just feel actually terrible. That you guys can't see me play the two different versions, which in the future I'm hoping we will. If I like this, I'm definitely gonna like the uh, other version. Because it's still the same game in a sense, but it's PC model. Like, I can hook it up to my PC. Like, I'm getting a wire for my quest to hook up, and I can do it to my laptop as well. So, actually, in a sense, I could just hook it up to my laptop, I'm assuming. I just don't know where it is right now. But my laptop, I feel like, is broken because it's not been running, and I would have loved to run videos on that thing. Like, but I feel like that would be, like, kind of a little bit weird. This guy sounds like a, like a person who would say that because they're going crazy. I like how there's like a radio system in the headset, but you can't talk to them for, for like like what to do next if you if you didn't listen. That was easier said than done. I played this mission like 20 times, and every time, like, I always think that it would be amazing to actually, uh, you know, get some light on this area a lot. 
because it would look cool. Like, a lot of people would use the tactical flashlight. Like, who wouldn't? Like, I would. Like, a lot of people have used it in, in for their videos. Like, a lot of YouTubers have used it. And this is where I feel like Zero Caliber, like, the creators of Zero Caliber, X Real or something. I don't know how you say it. But the creator does play this game. And if he, like, likes watching people who play Zero Caliber, he may, like like my channel because i'm just saying i would love to see some of his like earlier creations or something like that like his earlier creations such as like the uh the tactical flashlight from like 2018 and everything so that would be nice to see and i would most definitely support that piece like even though it's just like yeah it's a small attachment piece, but come on it would bring great use to the channel as well i died to an ai apparently it like i said it'd be, it would bring great use to the channel Do it this. But I do love this version so much. Like the like the guns look so like do look realistic. They look amazing. It was definitely worth my money. Like, that's what I have to say. That's where. It, it, but also the missions like are so good. Like some things have changed opposed to the actual version versions. I have not seen much in um, design though. Like like design change. Like where I'm saying like, like the, the maps have a sort of like turn kind of differently like they take a different turn in place. but everything is really real the sniper rifles do a lot of damage and so do the shotguns that's where I say it like works out pretty well for people like me Nice try kicking me, dude, but you died. That scared me. Civilians in sight. Hold your fire. Roger that, Lieutenant. <sighs> like that this map, yeah, like you guys could tell where I would say the lighting would actually work very well. Yeah, there's actually darkness in this, which would be nice to have the uh, flashlights and i and i think they were trying to work on graphics as well i think a little bit we're with the okay. OSA. we're not gonna go through that You're safe now oh and it's all mm, nice and shiny arm like it's that never gets old though that is funny but it never gets old But anyways, guys, I think that's going to wrap it up for this episode. Make sure to like, subscribe, turn on notifications. See you guys next time.